Welcome back. Now to a medical first. The recipient of the Pioneer Pig Kidney Transplant is out of the hospital, celebrating life and no longer needing dialysis. Here's ABC's Lionel Moyes. This morning, Rick Slayman, the first living person to receive a genetically edited pig kidney, is beginning his new life. These photos were taken moments before he was released from Mass General Hospital yesterday. After nearly three weeks of recovery, the 62-year-old is thanking his doctors and nurses, saying this moment, leaving the hospital today with one of the cleanest bills of health I've had in a long time, is one I wished would come for many years. Now it's a reality and one of the happiest moments of my life. We're going to learn a lot with Mr. Slayman. He was brave to go through a procedure where there were so many unknowns. Dr. Leo Riella, who helped perform the four-hour procedure last month, says Slayman is doing well despite some initial complications in the days after the surgery. What he taught us is that it is possible. Slayman was living with end-stage kidney disease and was on dialysis at the time of his operation. The pioneering transplant is now offering hope to nearly 90,000 other kidney patients currently on dialysis. Hopefully then, you know, bring it to clinical practice, bring to all patients that are on the waiting list that don't have a kidney and may have to wait too long. Lionel Moyes, ABC News, New York.